Hello ladies, gentlemen, children, and everybody else watching this video that I did not just mention. My name is Cookies and let's play Zombie Nation. So in the background you can see the story, which I won't read it all. Because I don't really care for the story. Um if you really want to care about the story, just read it in the background, pause if you need to, but um, I'll just give you guys a quick, like, a, a nutshell version of the story. A meteorite crashed uh, in Nevada Desert, uh, that meteorite was Darkseed, a powerful alien that turned all of America into zombies, brought the Statue of Liberty to life to do its bidding, uh, got control of a sword called Shua, and uh, you play as a giant samurai head, and you are the only one with the power to stop Darkseed. So let's just jump into the game. And uh, yeah, that, that, that is the samurai head you play as. Um, I don't actually remember what his name was. I didn't look at it in the background, but those people you can see, uh, the ones falling through the build buildings, those are actually power-ups in this game. Uh, the people on the rooftop that shoot you, they are not power-ups. Like, those guys, those guys are power-ups. But the ones falling and saying help are power-ups. And um, I just want to say something. If you're expecting zombies in this game, then sadly you're going to be disappointed. There are zombies, theoretically, but they're all in, like, as you can see, they're like, in tanks and helicopters, they're not really traditional zombies. And don't ask why you play as a giant samurai head, this game is just really odd. So, uh, you spew vomit and shoot lasers from your eyes. And that is your source of attack in this game. Spewing vomit and shooting lasers out of your eyes. Now that I think about it, that's really stupid. Why, why does your vomit explode? I don't know. Um, if you're wondering those giant light beam things in the background, those can actually uh, kill you. Uh, they're, uh, they're pretty much an instant death to touch them, so don't touch them. And uh, we're almost at the end of the first, not the first, well the first part of the first stage, but yeah, we're about halfway through the first stage. Blimps! Kill the blimps, no one likes blimps. Damn blimps. I actually really like the music of this game. Uh, I don't know why. Actually, I don't think you shoot uh, laser beams out of your eyes. I think you shoot your eyes out of your eyes. Because they kind of look like eyes, not laser beams. So you kill zombies by shooting eyes at them and spewing vomit. I just don't know. This game is really just. Ugh, this game is stupid. Why am I playing this game? I mean, yeah, it's an okay game. It has a really nice soundtrack, but most games from the NES has a decent soundtrack. Even that, which the soundtrack in this game gets pretty repetitive. Touch the laser. Shoot the zombies in the face. Yeah, it gets really, really repetitive after a while. No more with you. How old? How is everyone? I'm doing good. Um, I hope you're doing good. 
but yeah. God, this music. Well, luckily we're almost at the end of the first stage. And I'm almost out of things to talk about for this game. Um... Well, there's not much to say. You play as a giant head, shooting eyeballs, and vomiting on your enemies. And the first stage boss is the Statue of Liberty. The hell is made out of snakes, it has fire, it spews bubble and stuff, and it dies really fast. Wasn't that fun? Anyways, that's it for stage one. I'll see you guys for stage two. See you later. Bye.